Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. How are you guys doing today? So today I'm here with Wilhelmina, and you guys are getting a sneak peek of her outfits because this is her back to school dress, but I took all her accessories and stuff off so you guys don't see her full outfit because I wanted to share with you guys what I was working on today. Um, so I was sewing today and I did get a little bit frustrated because I'm making something for her and I realized that I didn't tape all of the pieces together and I only cut like half of what I needed. So that's frustrating. Anyway, so, ta-da, I made her some of these little fuzzy socks. Now, as you know, winter is coming and this is the first year that... I have a smart doll in the winter, so she doesn't have anything. Now, this is my second pair of socks. If you um seen in another video, I did make socks, but they were um they were fuzzy socks too. They were oh, what were they called? Um, mermaid scale type fabric, but they were fuzzy like these. Anyway, so I just sewed these up today, and I think they look super cute. I love them. They kind of look like boot, like slippers, like booty slippers, but they're actually socks. I'm very proud. The only thing is it does fray out a little bit. And I did get this fabric cheap. This is fur fabric that I got from Timu that I actually bought to make a um, carpet or a rug out of. And I just had it on hand and I'm like, I can use that for stuff. So I've been using this. This is just the last bit of what I used it for. You'll see it multiple times. Anyway, but I wanted to show you this is super, super easy if you want to make socks for your smart doll. Um, I could do a tutorial on it. Let me know if you want to see me actually make the socks so you guys can see. Maybe you guys want to make socks for your smart dolls or whatever, but it's super easy, super simple, and I love it. And you can make any kind. It doesn't have to be fuzzy. I just thought winter's coming and her feet are going to get cold and she's lounging around in the house so she definitely needs slippers and fuzzy socks and that's another thing i'm working on i'm working on slippers um for smart dolls and i'm not going to say what else i was working on i was working on two other things so you're going to see it come closer to the holiday because it is the one is holiday related so you're not going to see that so it's closer to christmas because it is christmas related yes i am thinking about christmas already guys i already start sewing for christmas so i love it um i can't wait to decorate this room for the holidays it's gonna be so much fun um and as you can see i'm just using her smart doll box as like a bed or something for her to like sit on <laughs> anyway this is getting too long i believe so I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share. I love you guys. And remember, keep doing what you're doing in this hobby. Um, even if you get haters. Because I recently got someone who called me crazy on my My Mythical Creatures video with Jack Frost. Because I made a story up. So, what gets me is that what is the difference between me and you know like telling a story versus a movie or like something else you know what i mean that adults do because adults there are children um storytellers and stuff like that so what makes me different you know what i mean like what makes me so crazy and that these other people aren't but you know what it didn't phase me because they gave me a comment so that means they watched my video and they also gave me